Authorities have completed another day of searching for a missing 15-year-old girl who disappeared in the waters off Pier Marquette Beach. Muskegon police say the girl was swimming with three other teenagers around 7.30 Friday evening. Rescuers searched the waters of Lake Michigan again today but could not locate the girl. The missing girl was not from the area. She was visiting Muskegon with her family when she became caught in a rip current with her younger sister. Today, WZCM 13's Hannah Saunders spoke with a friend who was with the missing girl last night. Charlie Smith and his girlfriend Morgan took a quick trip to Pier Marquette Friday for a routine swim. We probably went in about waist deep and we didn't notice that we were getting pulled out until we couldn't touch anymore. Charlie says he swims well and knew to swim parallel to the shoreline as he tried to get Morgan's attention about the rip current he was starting to feel. I'm like, what are you doing? She's like, there's those two girls over there. They were pushing each other under trying to breathe. Charlie and Morgan swam closer to try to help the 15-year-old girl and her sister, but Morgan got too close. One of the girls was like panicking, trying to, she was trying to get on top of my girlfriend to try to like gasp for air. Charlie pulled Morgan out of the way, then tried to help the two girls. They couldn't calm down, they wouldn't listen to me. I was like, you gotta, even if you can't swim, you gotta try. Your life is literally on the line right now. Charlie wasn't able to get a grip on either of them. Then he noticed Morgan struggling to stay above water. That's when he had to decide to take Morgan back. I'm gonna feel bad about this, but there's really nothing I could do, otherwise we'd probably all be dead. Now Charlie's family is trying to help him process what happened. I couldn't believe that he almost didn't come home. While they mourn for what the family of the two sisters are going through. It's something that is gonna lay hard in their mind for the rest of their lives. It can happen to anybody. That was Hannah Saunders reporting. The younger sister was able to get to shore with help from some other swimmers, the Muskegon Sheriff's Department tells us the search will continue until rescuers have exhausted all efforts.